how to install PG Vector in PostgreSQL. Let's get started. So as technology continues to grow, people and businesses are looking for smarter ways to handle information. Regular database store data like names, numbers, and dates. But today, we also need to work with more complex data like text for conversation, image, and search queries. These types of data are often turned into vectors, which are listed as a number that computers can understand. Vectors help machines make decisions, answer questions, and find things that are similar in meaning. This is where PG Vector comes very useful. PG Vector is an extension that works with PostgreSQL, one of the most trusted and popular databases in the world. With PG Vector, you can store and search this list of numbers, also called vector embeddings, directly into your PostgreSQL database. This allows you to build smart features like recommendation system, AI search tool, and chatbots without needing complicated system. So in this video, we'll explain to you what is PostgreSQL, what is PG Vector, and the many benefits of installing PG Vector into your PostgreSQL database. So first, what is PostgreSQL? PostgreSQL is an open source database. This means it is free and you can change it to fit your needs. It has been around for over 30 years and is known for being strong, reliable, and secure. Many developers, companies, and apps use PostgreSQL to store data like users, products, payments, and many more. PostgreSQL lets you run many kinds of queries. You can filter, sort, join, and group your data. It also supports features like transactions, which helps you make sure your data stays safe even if something goes wrong. It works well with many programming languages like Python, JavaScript, and Java. Most people use PostgreSQL to store structured data. That means data that fits into tables with rows and columns. But with the rise of artificial intelligence and machine learning, we now also want to store vector data which is less structured. This is where PG Vector comes in. PG Vector is a special add-on or extension for PostgreSQL. It lets you store and search vector embeddings in your database. A vector is just a list of numbers like 0 0.1, 0 0.2, or 0 0.3 that represents something like sentence, a photo, or even a sound. These vectors are created by AI models such as OpenAI's ChatGPT, BERT, or CLIP. For example, if you have a sentence like, How is the weather today? An AI model can turn it to, into a vector. Then, if someone else asks a similar question like, What's the weather like now? The model can compare both vectors and see that they are close in meaning, even if the words are different. PG Vector allows you to save these vectors in PostgreSQL tables, but it doesn't just store them. It also lets you search and compare them using similarity measures like cosine distance and inner product. These methods help you find items that are most similar to each other. Now that you understand what PostgreSQL and PG Vector are, now let's talk about the benefits of using them together. So first, store vector data easily. So one of the biggest benefits of PG Vector is that it lets you store vector data directly into your PostgreSQL database. You don't need to use a different system or learn a new tool. Everything stays in one place. So this makes it easier to manage your data, especially when you are working on projects that involve artificial intelligence or machine learning. Next. Search for similar results. PG Vector makes it possible to search by meaning, not just words. This is called semantic search. For example, if you search if you search for how to learn Python, the database can return results like beginner's guide to Python programming, 
because the meaning are similar, even if the words are not the same. This is much better than keyword search, which only looks for exact words. Semantic search helps you build smarter apps, such as intelligent chatbots, help centers, or search engines. Next, index support for faster searches. PG Vector allows you to create indexes on your vector columns. An index is like a shortcut that helps the database find data quickly. When your database has thousands or millions of vectors, searches can be slow. But with PG Vector, you can use an index to make searches more faster. This is very helpful for real-time systems like recommendation engines where speed is very important. Next, all your data in one place. Without PG Vector, you might need to use a separate vector database like Pinecone. This means extra work, extra costs, and more things to manage. With PG Vector, you keep everything in PostgreSQL. You can store your text, images, labels, and vectors all in the same table. This makes your setup cleaner and easier to work with. PG Vector works great with AI tools like OpenAI, Hugging Face, Langchain, and Phyton libraries. If you are building an app that uses AI, you can take your vector embeddings from OpenAI or any model and store them directly in PostgreSQL with PG Vector. You don't need to change your setup or learn a new system. This makes it easier for developers to add smart features to their application such as personalized recommendations or questions answer system. Safe, secure, and trusted. PostgreSQL is known for being safe and secure. By using PG Vector inside PostgreSQL, you get all the same safety features. Same safety features. This includes backups, user permissions, and transaction support. If you already trust PostgreSQL with your business data, you can also trust it with your vector data. Next, saves you money. Using PG Vector means you don't need to pay for extra services or databases. You can use your existing PostgreSQL setup. Many cloud services also support PG Vector, so you can use it with providers like Supabase, Render, or Heroku. This makes PG Vector a cost effective choice, especially for startups, small business, or personal projects. So for you to be able to install PG Vector in PostgreSQL, you need to follow these steps depending on your operating system and setup. PG Vector is a PostgreSQL extension that allows you to store and search vector embeddings like those used in AI and machine learning models. So first, you want to check the requirements. The first requirement should be the PostgreSQL version 12 or higher, so recommended would be 13 plus. Super user access to your PostgreSQL instance and make and GCC tools for building from source. Installing methods, option A, using package managers. This should be on Ubuntu and Debian. You can use this code right here for Ubuntu and Debian. And for Mac OS, you may use this code right here. Now, option B, inside the Docker, if you are using Docker for PostgreSQL, add this to your Docker file or in its script. Now you want to enable the extension in PostgreSQL. After installing the extension, connect to your database using this code. Now to test your work, create a sample table with vector column. And that's how you can install PG Vector in PostgreSQL. And that's it. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in the next one.